This video is brought to you by Ugreen. Managing large media files can be a pain. External drives pile up, cloud storage gets pricey, and backups often fall through the cracks. Well, that's where this comes in. The Ugreen NAS Sync DXP4800 Plus is a smarter, private cloud system with AI photo management, RAID protection, remote access, and backup automation all in one box. So who's this for? This is designed for creators, photographers, filmmakers, and anyone who works with a lot of files. It connects locally through a network, works across devices, and gives centralized access from anywhere. Now the NAS unit comes with most everything that you need. So inside the unit, you get some tools. You also get some SSD pads because you could also put SSDs in there. And then also they provide you with these two ethernet cables, which is pretty cool to have those provided. The DXP4800 Plus is compatible with third-party hard drives from brands like Seagate, Western Digital, Toshiba, and more. And with four drive bays and two M.2 SSD slots, it supports up to 112 terabytes of storage. And that's enough for pretty much 39 million photos, or it can also host 76,000 HD movies, making it ideal for long-term archiving and high volume media workflows. Now, the way that this works is pretty cool. You got your four slots right here. All you have to do is push this button. See that pop up? You pull here gently and you pull this out and there's one of your trays. Now I've already got this loaded up with 16 terabytes as a whole. I got a four terabyte NAS drive in this one, as you can see here. And what's really cool is that you can install it without tools. So let me show you how this works. If I flip this over right here, it says press. If I press and pull, you see how that expands? And then if I flip it over, I'm gonna be very gentle so that this doesn't fall out, but you'll see that's all that it takes. Now in your drive, you'll see you have these areas for screws on the side. I mean, that's pretty standard. And then inside of the drive bay, you have four plastic pins that'll hold it into place. So the way to install it is I just set this in very lightly. I align the holes up with those pins. I push it in on this side and that won't slide out of place. I then push this in and that locks in. And now that won't slide out. And so now my drive is in place and all I have to do to get this in there properly is I set it upright again and I push in and I just push that right there and it's locked into place. So now I have all four of my bays. So it's kind of nice that you can install those drives without any tools. Now, I do want to note here that storage disks are not included and they need to be purchased separately. But thankfully, Ugreen provided me with this demo unit that has 16 terabytes of storage in it. To give you a little tour about the product, we've got our four bays. We've got a power button. There's light indicators right here that'll let you know the status of your NAS. You also have an SD card slot. You have USB-A and USB-C on the front side. So you could have this on top of your desk. And it's actually really not that loud, which I really, really like. You got this nice magnetic cover if you want to cover that fan some more. Let it catch some dust. Then you get your DC power reset. Then you have LAN 1, that's 10 gigabit E. The 2.5 gig, you have this LAN 2 right here. You got two USB-A, USB 2.0 ports. You've also got the USB-A 3.2 port and HDMI. So you've got a couple of ways to connect this. But for me, my setup, what I'm gonna do is I actually have my computer hardwired because I want the best speed that I have my computer, hard drive and network to my router. And then also I'm gonna hardwire this to the router as well. So I get a wired direct connection. So the way we get this to work is we plug in our power. We also have our ethernet, which I'm gonna plug into here into LAN one. And then I'll press the power button on the front and then go to work here. Now, once I have this plugged into my router, all I need to do is go to find.ugnas.com through my web browser. And that's gonna walk me through the setup process of how to set this thing up. But after that, you're pretty much good to go. What I love about this NAS is that it's super user friendly. I'm not a networking expert or a NAS expert or a storage expert. And so it walks me through the process and the NAS configuration I'm going with is RAID 5. Now RAID 5 keeps files safe by using three drives. So I've got four here. It's gonna use three of the drives to store the data and one for redundancy. So if one of these drives fail, it can be replaced in the system and the system automatically rebuilds the data using the remaining drives. So no file loss, no manual recovery and no downtime. The way I like to think about this is like puzzle pieces. So say I've got these four puzzle pieces right here that make up the whole puzzle. Well, if I'm missing one puzzle piece, given that I still have these three puzzle pieces here, 
I know what the general picture is based on these three that are left, and then I'll just kind of fill in the blank there of what that missing puzzle piece is. Now, once it's online, the NAS functions as a secure private cloud with full file ownership. Files can be uploaded remotely from a phone, browser, or desktop, and the files can be accessed from anywhere, including smart TVs. Whether uploading footage on set or working from home, collaborators can begin editing instantly. Okay, I'm gonna show you something really cool here. I'm gonna record a little video clip with my phone right here. And also I'm gonna show you right here, this is my folder, like my shared folder that I'm gonna upload things to. There's nothing in there yet, but I also have Premiere Pro open so that I can go there and start editing. So I'm filming, I'm about 15 seconds in. I stop recording. Then what I'll do is I will upload the file here. Let's see, I'll confirm. And I just started transferring now and you'll see right here in this folder is that file. So all I have to do next is drag this into Premiere Pro and there it is. And I could start editing from here. With the DXP 4800 Plus, transfers are fast. Whether you're using the 10 gigabit per second USB ports or the 2.5 gigabit E network connection, large files back up quickly with speeds reaching up to one gigabytes in under two seconds. Okay, I've got roughly a 14, 15 gigabyte file here. I'm gonna upload both to Google Drive and to the NAS. And I'm gonna drag it into Google Drive first just so we can see the comparison of the speed. I'll drag it into my folder on my server. Just gonna let that sit and let that transfer there. Now you see the NAS transferred at a pretty good speed there. Files can be shared by link, either view only or with upload permissions. Great for client handoffs or letting a teammate drop in footage from a shoot. Each user gets tailored access and nothing gets lost in the shuffle. Now folders on any connected computer can be backed up automatically. Just select the folder, set a schedule, and the NAS handles the rest quietly in the background. It's a smarter alternative to external drives, centralized, automated, and easy to restore when needed. So for example, I could do time machine backup on my computer, but instead of doing that, I am backing up directly to this NAS right here by choosing just the folders that I wanna back up. This is where it gets really smart. The built-in AI photo album organizes images by face, location, an object, and even scene. It can group similar shots, remove duplicates, and supports raw formats like CR2, ARW, and DNG, making photo management faster and more efficient. Files, photos, and media can be accessed from multiple devices like phone, computer, or tablet. The app lets users browse, stream, manage, and even upload or organize remotely. In daily use, the NAS runs quietly and reliably with a five core Intel CPU, eight gigabytes of DDR5 RAM. As mentioned, it features USB 3 and 2.0 ports, an SD card reader, 4K HDMI output, and cross-platform app access on Windows, Mac OS, Android, iOS, and even smart TVs. It can reach download speeds of up to 1250 megabytes per second, which is equivalent to downloading one terabyte of files in about 20 minutes, which is ideal for fast backups and production workflows. So who's the DXP 4800 Plus for? Well, whether if you're working solo, on a team, or managing decades of media, the Ugreen NAS Sync DXP 4800 Plus system brings security, speed, and a structure to any creative workflow. With centralized storage, RAID recovery, AI photo tools, and fast access from anywhere. It's a flexible solution for creators, hobbyists, small teams, and families alike. So huge thanks again to Ugreen for sponsoring this video and making a NAS that fits the needs of creators, editors, and media professionals. Between the AI features, the flexibility, and the performance, it's a strong option for anyone who needs reliable, secure footage. Now, if you want to check it out, there's a link in the description, and it is an affiliate link, which means it doesn't cost anything extra, but it helps support the channel if a purchase is made. And if you act fast, at the time this video is published, there's a 15% off discount available on the Ugreen NAS Sync DXP 4800 Plus, so take advantage of that. And if you find this video helpful, give it a like, drop a comment, and share it with a fellow creator. And if you're into cameras, tech, and creative tools, hit subscribe and smash that bell so you don't miss the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.